All right, I can't pin her down for it, so you're gonna see my messy, newly moved into house. This house is gonna be so badass when it's done. Preston's room is already gorgeous. I mean, we just gotta decorate it, man. I love this house. Check it out, guys. It's Thomas's bedroom's already pretty much set up. I've only been in here, what, six nights, boo? Uh, this is just the upstairs. Look at this loft. We got to get a stand for the TV, but for now we got it sitting here. That IKEA furniture. Look at that freaking loft. Anyway. Stand we're getting because we get in black. Yeah, we're getting in black. We like IKEA. Our bedroom, box disaster. Master bathroom. Man, I love this freaking place. All right. So check it. Oh, here's Cammy's awesome room. Cammy's got. It's a little dark, sorry about that, it's a little dark outside. It's got, you know, girls room, we're gonna get our bigger bed. Her own bathroom, hold on. Her own bathroom. You know, her own friggin', what a spoiled little brat. Her own friggin' walk-in closet with built-in shelving. Anyway, Katie, yeah. I get emails every friggin' day. Stop doing housework, woman, you're, you're on relief. Look at that man, look at him, look how big he is. What are you doing? Where's your face? Where's your face? Hey. Hey. <laughs> Stinko. He's got Thomas' hat. Katie. Yes. Alright. You can probably tell she's lost a bit of weight. You lost what, five, six pounds this last week? Something like that. Now, we took a little break off the road to Milf. One was that the move was unexpected when we started this. And uh, Katie's been at the gym consistently for two weeks. She had to handle a lot of things. I work a lot, I was traveling a lot. We decided that she's gonna just eat healthy. She's back in the gym, losing weight, doing her thing. What do you gotta say? So you took time off, you also had the uh, mastitis issue. That took you out of the gym. Mastitis, for you all don't know, it's a titty infection from um, when, you, when she stopped you know, breastfeeding, the milk kinda got wezzed up, and it messes up your immune system, am I correct? It messes up, well, no, it wasn't mastitis, he had thrush. He had thrush. Which is a yeast infection. So it's a boob infection in your, your skin. Okay, so you have a vaginal. Yeah, it was the worst pain I've ever been in my whole life, literally. Really? Yes. Childbirth? Yes. Yeah, drugs during childbirth. We should have given you drugs then. I have plenty of drugs. It me transdermal d drugs. It still hurt. You, you were on that methyl one test rub on. Anyway, so how you feeling? Give us an update. Um, let's see. I'm back at the gym and I did legs today. And legs. My strength is coming back gradually, so like today, let's see, I, I used to like squat, what, like a 45 on each side. Easily. Yeah. So, I had a whopping 15 pounds on each side. 15 pounds. <laughs> Which is good, because last week I didn't put any weight on, and I did stiff leg deadlifts with 35 on each side, so my strength's coming back every week, and I add more weight every week. Um, yeah, uh, it's a nice gym. There's lots of different equipment, so I'm trying new machines. Let us know about your diet. Now, you got a program by the foremost trainer in America. Who's that? <laughs> Van. <laughs> no, Mark Lobliner, the machine. Okay, so my diet, I shall tell you, is on my list right here. Okay, so my diet is on training days, 200 grams of protein, 180 grams of carbs, and 80 grams of fat. And uh, I think I finally figured out how to get there. A lot of days I was under. I ate way less than I thought I did. Way less. Um, and then you have me with a free meal every Saturday, which I didn't even do last Saturday. Mm -hmm. Now, for those of my clients who ask where your free meal is, you know, um, if you are a family person, I can, you know, I, I, I make diets to fit what clients can do and Katie has a very good sense of not eating stuff. A lot of clients, you give them a free meal, they end up eating the entire, I just did a video on nice fart, Preston just friggin' pooted man, yeah. that was a good fart, ah, that <laughs> smile. Alright, so, so basically we got your calories set, um, problem is getting your food. Yeah, okay, in my off training days you have it at 210 protein, 150 carbs, 85 fat. So I just try to get like pretty close to that. She gets within 10%, which is all I ask, and, and this is a lifestyle program. Since we moved, we ditched all the crap food that was in the house. Because so of Cammy. 
Damn her. <laughs> so Cammy, we were she was looking at the we were moving. She's like, Daddy, when we move, we shouldn't have junk food in the house because I'm an athlete. And what am I gonna do? Say, damn it, Cammy, you must eat Pop Tarts. <laughs> so we're we're completely gone full hippie. And Katie and I, believe it or not, we like junk food once in a while, but we we gotta listen to Cammy on that one. Okay, so yeah. Uh, diets diets good, training's good. House is a mess, so. Yeah, oh, we don't Preston, normally. No, get him. Preston, Preston, out of the cubby hole. Childproof yet, so. Uh, <laughs> not out. Mark, it's, the furniture's not mounted on the wall yet. Either. Honey, he's not fat enough to pull that down. All right, so, um, here's the deal. The road to MILF is back. It, it, it just took a pause because of booby infections, yeast infections in the booby, vaginal, what, whatever the hell's going on with that thrush. Sounds like a band. And uh, Katie's on point. I guarantee you we're going to lose one to two pounds a week. The first few weeks we might even lose more. This week we're losing five to six. Um, just from water weight and just cleaning it up. She can't cheat on her diet because we ain't got anything to cheat with unless she likes apples and pears. Um, Hurry up, we gotta get the kids to the bus stop. <laughs> and I gotta get the kids from the bus stop. I gotta work. I still got a few hours of work left tonight. Katie, please sign us off. Is. Uh, uh, I got it. Being a MILF, it's not a game! <laughs> <laughs>